it's late March and it's snowing, but still I'm going to do this quick video on behalf of the Cooperative Gardens Commission to talk about the very basic set of tools that you'll need if you're a beginning gardener and you don't know what to get. Uh, what I have laid out here is more than you will need. There are some things here that that you will definitely need and some things you don't necessarily and depending on the scale of your garden that may all change. So you're going to need a trowel. A basic little hand trowel is good. Those other ones are slightly larger and they're nice but you don't need them. Uh, a, a standard shovel, a round point digging shovel, long handle, D handle, that's up to you. Um, a square point shovel is not what I would say is, is part of the very basic set. Um, they're handy for scooping things out of the bottom of a garden cart or wheelbarrow, but for basic digging you won't need them. Uh, it's nice to have a digging fork because it does things breaking up soil that a shovel slices through and it can save roots when you're digging. The one in behind there is not a digging fork. That's more of a pitchfork for handling hay and straw and, and mulch and compost materials. Uh, you'll want a basic bow rake and I put that cultivator in front of it. Uh, basic bow rake, the red one in back is a, a lawn landscape rake. It's nice, levels beds, but you don't need it. All you need is a basic bow rake. You'll need some kind of cultivator. Uh, this one and that one are good for heavy soil where you're trying to, to pull out weeds, but for just light scuffing up the surface, you might want something lighter. Um, you don't need all of those. Just find one that works for your soil. You will need some sort of a notebook or clipboard to take notes on. A kneeling pad is good. Gloves are good. Uh, if the soil's really flying while you're digging at things, you might want some safety glasses. A hat with a brim is good for keeping the sun off of you. These are lawn rakes. Good for gathering leaves and things, but not really garden rakes. You don't necessarily need those. If you're going to be marking things out and driving stakes, you'll need stakes and string and a hammer to drive them with. A bucket is handy. A truck is handy. Um, should be easy to scavenge something like that. Come harvest time, you also may want a small set of pruners like that. And a harvest knife, which I don't have out here. You will probably also want a wheelbarrow or a garden cart. And remember with those, it's likely it's going into your garden. So plan on your rows being able to accommodate your, your cart to get somewhere close to where you're going to be bringing things inside the garden. And then for watering, yeah, you'll want a hose and you'll want a valve on the end of the hose and maybe a, uh, a wand with a rose like that can put water down softly without spraying things away like the nozzle on the left would. And you'll want a watering uh, a sprinkler for watering large areas. Um, and that's about it.